Roanoke Outside really helped connect us to groups that were, had similar interests to a project that we were interested in, and that is the dock at Carvin's Cove. Uh, Roanoke Outside helped us fundraise for that dock and get it installed at Carvin's Cove so that we could then bring other paddle sports to the community. So I grew up in Roanoke, Virginia, uh, moved away to college and past that, um, seeing the growth in the outdoor community um, in part helped by Roanoke Outside really allowed us to consider Roanoke as a place to live um, and conduct our business with Revolution Rowing. In 2016, we were still living in Georgia, and at that time, uh, through an old family friend of Lauren's, Beth Dowdy, we were actually able to meet Pete Eshelman, and he was kind enough to meet with us before GoFest while he was setting up for it in 2016. And it was him talking about uh, everything that was going on with Roanoke outside and potentially putting a dock in at Carvin's Cove that was the straw that broke the camel's back for us, you know, considering two towns really. It was Greenville, South Carolina and Roanoke, Virginia. That night we were over at Grace's Pizza in Granite Village and we just simply toasted to the fact that we were moving <laughs> to Roanoke, Virginia. We knew it yeah. was time. I'm Jim. I'm Lauren. Go, Go outside! outside.